No. Zod. I can't be a part of this. Welcome back to ANR Talk. How everybody's doing today? Uh, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel for all your TV news, TV reactions, and all that good stuff in the world. Today is just about me ranting right now. Uh, this morning I was reading mad news about uh about Superman Henry Cravel leaving the thing. I was like, nah, this is BS. This this is no way. Then I kept I kept reading more and looking into these sources. I was like, there is a legit chance that this is real. And then when I kept going in and when I looked at uh, the sources I looked into, this is legit. And then it was going back about when he joined the Witcher and the series and stuff. I knew there was something fishy about it. Warner Brothers, Warner Bros, and and then the way they they've been doing the whole DC stuff, it's is is utterly disgusting, and it just it's it's so hor horrid on what they just did. How are you going to lose your main guy that started the DCU and Henry Cavill is a top draw and how big he's becoming as a star and how everyone loves the Superman franchise and what he's done and they just, they're just low key like just, just stabbing people in the back of what they're doing and then they're making excuses of all oh, but conflicting issues and did it. Try and use words to make an easy way out so they could get out of a situation that they're a hundred percent totally in fault of like he was supposed to be in a shazam cameo and they're like oh negotiations fell out this and that this has been in negotiations since man of steel one for man of steel two movie how it's been the man of steel movie came out um 2012 i believe we're about to go into 20 fucking 19 and we still haven't got a Man of Steel 2. We're on Wonder Woman 2. We're on a damn Aquaman movie. The Flash movie's coming out. And we had a Man of... So, now all of this is happening. It's, it's done. It's clarified. No Batman Affleck as Batman anymore. That's done. Um, there's still a chance that um, negotiation stuff, they could somehow fix this issue. And um, for him to come back at Superman and do this. But as of now... It looks like it's dead. There's always a possibility. But if this is dead, I'm here reading these dead reports that they think about doing a Supergirl movie. It's, it's just, this This is just mind-boggling. The words that I want to say, I can't even say right now. Because this is, this is just, this is just done. This man, Henry Cavill has his dog name as Cal. Cal-El. This is proves how much this man wants to be Superman and this man videos... And that you could go ahead and look up right now how he said he wanna be Superman for as long as his body can take it. This man was talking about trying to be Superman for a damn decade, okay? This man would have been Superman in the year 3000 if he could have. This man loved this role. And look, you know what? The, like, I'm not even as excited to see Aquaman and stuff like this or the next Joker movie just because the, the of what they're doing with all their pieces and all these movies is just you, you don't, don't care for it no more. It's like having a girlfriend, dog. It don't matter how fine she is. She cheats on you one time, maybe you forgive her. The second time, you're like, blood clot, get out of my life. Like, you're done with it. You're done. There's nothing she can do, ever. I don't care if she gets you a threesome, if she gets her homegirl. No, it's done. You look, you might you might entertain a threesome, but, that, but the relationship is done. There's no going back to it. That's how I feel. I don't give a damn. Let me know what you thought about this video. Comment down about how you feel about the situation because I don't, I give nothing about it. Just hit that like button. Subscribe for many more of my channels. This is A&R Talk and I am.